Hey y'all, this is Gloria. Today is Saturday, April the 20th, 2013. I started my day out kind of uh, crappy. I've got some, um, you know, sad news stuff. My sister's uh, gotten a lot worse and, um, you know, they said that she'd be lucky to make it through the weekend. And... You know, it, it's just tore me up really bad. It, it's hard knowing somebody that young is dying from cancer when it could have been prevented if the doctors had done their job. But, um, you know, I'm very thankful that I have friends, um, you know, that's there to, you know, try to... Um, support me, uh, give me shoulder to cry on and everything. Uh, y'all have to excuse my, my mess. I thought this morning, I thought, well, there's nothing I can do at this point, but just hope and pray that, um, the good Lord above don't let her keep suffering that way. So I thought, well, I need to do something because you know, my inside just felt like just one big bowl of jello. I mean, I was just, just shaky on the inside. So I decided, uh, well, I'll go to the gym, get a good workout. And that's what I did. And I went to the gym. Well, first I met, uh, my friend. I got a, uh, my workout buddy. I met her and we had, uh, you know, a little breakfast and, um, we went to the gym and, I was there probably an hour. Just had an excellent workout. And then I told her, I said, well, um, my husband called me and told me um, he was in town if we wanted to, you know, go grocery shopping or what have you. So, I thought, well, I might be, you know, you know, a little something to help me get my mind off of stuff. So, uh, I met up with him and we went and had some lunch, and I was telling myself, you know what? I can't keep beating myself up like this because it's out of my hands. It's in God's hands. So I told myself, well, I said, let's do something. I got to do something. So uh, I told myself, well, he said, what do you want to do? I said, well, I want to get my nose pierced. She's like, what? I said, I want to go get my nose Pierced. I had it pierced once before and it hurt and I had it for probably about a month and never did get no better because uh, the guy had me putting um, some kind of back tracing or something like that on it and oh lord it's a raw. So I took it out because the hole was actually bigger than the jewelry itself. So I took it out and let it grow back up and I've always missed it because I'm always somebody like to be different. That's just me, you know, tattoos and piercings and, uh, not too many piercings, though. So, we just made a little drive and I went, uh, to a place a guy I knew that was a totally different, um, uh, tattoo person, piercing person and, you know, talked to him about it and he made suggestions. So, got my nose pierced. You can see it. See that? It's still... Still kind of red, but I like it. When I saw uh, Mandy Gray's this morning on one of her pictures on Facebook, I thought, how cool. Well, I'm going to tilt it here because i got a different thing. I thought, that's so cool and I missed mine so bad. So that's what I did. Went and got my nose tat or pierced. Um, but it, it was something to get me out of the house. Um, I showed pictures to my sisters and all that. And... Uh, you know, they say, oh, look cute. And I say, well, y'all need to get y'all done. They're not as brave as I am, though. Well, my hubby's home from um, getting, picking his car up in town. I dropped him off. But I just wanted to check in with everybody and let you know I'm still around. Oh, one other thing. When he went to lunch, we went and had um, Chinese, which I had the usual, I consider like snacky stuff I had oysters and mussels and uh, tried wonton soup. I'd never had that before and I thought I'd try it. That's basically it. Well, I had uh, some grilled chicken. I told him, I said, you know, 
the way I feel today, I wish that I could eat and eat and eat until the pain goes away. But he reminded me, he said, well, hey, so what was the point of you going to working out this morning and working hard on it to go and gorge yourself and take, you know, steps back? And he said, plus the way your stomach's been lately, there's no way you can eat that much because it um, makes you sick, which it does. But uh, I told him, I said, you know, you're right. So I managed to walk away from um, wanting to uh, fill the uh, herd up with food to make it go away. Which I know it wasn't, and I would just wind up being in uh, physical pain. So I'm glad he was there. You know, he kind of surprised me, uh, reminded me. But I was glad he was there. It's nice to have a good husband like him to watch my back when I need him. Well, I don't want to bring everybody down. It's a beautiful day outside, and me and him, uh, we enjoyed ourselves. You know, it took a drove a drive to the next town over and you know, got to see the sights and I saw quite a few people today in different places I didn't expect to see anybody that I knew anyway. Well, y'all have a great rest of the weekend and enjoy yourselves. Remember to tell that loved one you love them. Don't let the moments pass you by. Love y'all. Talk to you later. Bye.